When we talk to people about adoption and, and the timeline is a concern, one of the things that people tend to self-limit. You know, I, I only want a baby, I only, you know, I'm not willing to consider exposure, I'm not willing to consider special needs. Well, once you check all those boxes, you've narrowed the universe of possible matches that you could look at. There are more birth parents than there usually are adoptive babies. That's, I think, generally true, particularly in the North, the ratios are different than they are in Southern states. Um, and so it varies. So the private system is going to feel a little different than the public system. The choices that the adoptive parents are making are going to limit their options. Same thing. We have families out there that are waiting, but they also have a very small net of who they're willing to consider that we might not have the right child for them. Mm -hmm. And we have, so we have children that are waiting for the right family um, for them. We don't want to just put a child with a family. We'd rather put the family with the child, if that makes sense. And so that's a really big component to that is really educating our families out there that are interested in adoption as to who these children are and who um, and what their needs are in order to support um, that adoption finalization. Yeah.